Young people have every reason to be enraged, and every issue they see, they look up, they get angry, and they see someone doing better than them, and then every day it is speedballed in their face that they are failing. For the first time in our nation's history, a 30-year-old man or woman isn't doing as well as his or her parents were at 30. That is the social compact breaking down. People aged 30 to 34, 60% of them in 1990 had one child, now it's 27%. People are opting out of America, they're not optimistic about it, they're not having kids. Young people are enraged, they look up, they they see wealth, exceptional wealth across my generation and people in certain industries, and they are really struggling. Their purchasing power is going down, and the incumbents create artificial scarcity on campus. We take pride in rejecting 90% of our applicants, so the incumbents who already have a degree see their degree go up in value. Housing prices have gone from 290 to 420 in the last four years. We have lost the script. Our kids are more anxious, they're more depressed, they're more obese, they're more addicted, and we have made a purposeful decision to let this happen by ensuring the people around this table stay wealthy at the cost of young people.